So we're going to play a little game. If you get the trick, then I have to drink. If you don't get the, the trick, okay. then you got to drink. Get your fucking ciggy butts out, baby. Put your lighters and lighters in the air for the fucking three of clubs, baby. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fuck. Not the three of clubs. For the listeners out there, right? Michael's a friend of mine. He likes magic in a very interesting way, which we're going to explore that today. We have a very full packed episode today, but I want to show you just mm -hmm. how fun, okay, right? Podcasts can be. I'm going okay. to turn your, I'm going to turn you around, Michael. Are you ready? Yep. Okay. Woo! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Let's fucking go, baby. <laughs> Do what? <laughs> I, like I can't that. even. I realize I can't <laughs> put this on. Uh, you need some tape or something. All right. Back in your head. You fucking dog. Pick a card, mate. Uh, Pick a fucking card. Three of clubs. Three of clubs. Yeah. For his own. Three of fucking clubs. Yeah. I may have. All right. All right. Okay. Get your fucking ciggy butts out, baby. <laughs> Put your lighters and lighters in the air. Yeah. For the fucking three of clubs, baby. Yes, that is. Suspiciously set up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why the but fuck did you say three of clubs? Was that genuinely just on top? Yeah. I think I may have seen it as you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, fuck. Not the three of clubs. I did I did get you some shit too, all right? Just in case you were feeling left out. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> throw it, throw it, throw it. <laughs> I think <laughs> I just look like you. <laughs> you look like you're from fucking, like from 1960, right. like about to go to the I've train a, station. I've got a steampunk hat. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're fucking. Oh god, you are someone that enjoys magic in a very interesting way. To me, the way you look at magic is almost like a magician because you care more about how the trick is done than almost anything else, right? Like, like you will obsess over the solution for like you know, half yeah. an hour and then work yeah. it out. I feel like you're hyping me up to be some kind of genius. IQ points mean nothing when you got magic. That's that's what I tell myself every day, <laughs> every <laughs> night before I fall asleep, <laughs> hugging myself. <laughs> I think what this leads to is a little bit of like, as I said, a combative performance style. So we're going to play a little game. If you get the trick, then I have to drink. Oh. If you don't get the, the trick, okay. then you got to drink. I'm going to get very drunk. Well, I don't think that's the case because I've layered them. So they go from, from easier to harder to harder to harder. Okay. okay. Number one. All right. This one, I fully expect you to, to be, to be not too bad at. All right. So let's try it. Number one. Say stop. Stop. <laughs> okay. Go again. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> touch one. Just touch one. It's okay. Take it out. Don't show me. All right. Mm -hmm. Yep. He's just seen a card, placed it back in the pack, and now he's cut and complete the pack as many times as he wanted. Now that <laughs> he's struggling with that mustache, <laughs> but you're struggling. <laughs> I want you to. Uh, can you like lower your glasses for a second? I'll try. There we go. There we go. And just look at my look at my hand as I go through. Okay. Look at my hand. There we go. Nice. And that was your selection, mm. Michael. Brown. He's got three cards on the table and he's just cutting them over and over again to try to figure out how they end up oh, and how- I'm gonna have to take this Yeah, off. take it off. <laughs> you are, you, you're gonna go over your caloric limit yeah. by fucking eating a mustache. That, but I, I, All right, I, cool, I cool, know. cool. So have a drink, have a drink. <laughs> Cheeky little drink right there. Have a nice one, all right. All right, all right, let's, tr let's try one more time. That's so, what I, I swear it's something to do with all right, try one more time. Yep, take one. Put it face down on the table. Just cutting the deck. Oh, cutting the deck. There we go. Actually, I've, to be honest, I've already forgotten what it was. Yeah, I forgot what I, I forgot my shit as well. <laughs> we both drink on that one. We both drink on that one. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I don't have any. Yeah, you got to get more fucking grapefruit in you, mate. It's healthy. This time your card was red for sure. Yes. Oh, uh, wait. I think it's about the card next to it. Hey, there yeah, it yeah. is. There it is. Yeah. All right, I'll drink to that one then. Some, you know. All right, go elaborate, elaborate. But I can't remember how you know the card oh, next to it. fuck. <laughs> Come on, man. I will drink on that one, but surely. Because every time I cut and and complete, mm -hmm. those two cards will end up being next to each the other. same yeah. each time. Yeah. Easy my ass. All right. <laughs> that was an easy one. All right. The other ones I'm not oh, expecting I'm you to get. Completely fucked then. <laughs> This is called Albanagra. 
This is the TikTok that went viral. 5.5 million <clears throat> million hits on TikTok. Two black kings. Mm -hmm. One red king. Mm -hmm. Follow the red king. Yes? Yep. Black? Black. Where is the red king? Okay, well, I'm led to believe it's in the middle. But, I mean. Is that what you're locking in? Sure, first time around. Hey, yeah, all right, all right, all right. I'll drink to that, I'll drink to that. <laughs> You just you just want to drink, so. All right, so. King of uh, King of Diamonds, Red King. Mm -hmm. Black, Black. I'll make it a bit harder. We'll do it like this, and like this. So, where would you say the Red King is? On the left. Here. No, my left. Oh, your left. Locking that in. Yeah. And that's when you're wrong, and you got to drink, my friend. Oh, very shit. good. Even very that. good. <laughs> Very good. I think holding it like this means that you can throw the one that's behind mm -hmm. like that. Nice. And it's fast enough that I can't see it. And I, I assume it's the one in front. Yeah. But I don't know how you do that. But Yep. That is the move. All right. I'll, I'll have a cheeky little. This is going to turn into a shit show fast, baby. <laughs> Very fast. Oh, we just need smaller slips. I don't think that's how it works, Michael. It's not how it fucking works, okay? Six, it's a six, six hours. hours, man. It's a six hours. What do you want me to do? This one I don't expect you to get, but we'll, we'll see what happens. I want you to imagine that you're holding a pack of cards. Okay. Like in your hand right now. Yep. Open the deck. I want you to look and see one card in there. Pull it out of the spread. Reverse it. Like flip it over? Yep. Put it back in the spread. Put it back in the box. Yeah. I'll take this back. Yeah, cool. So you got the red, red bicycles, right? What was the card that you flipped over? Three of clubs. The three of clubs. Yeah. Inside is one card the other way. Okay, that's impressive. Three of clubs. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, not going to get that one. You either fucking start coming up with some theories or you fucking chug that, chug that thing down, baby. What's your thought process? Let's hear it. Let's hear I, it. I'm stumped. <laughs> yeah, this was the one that I was expecting you to not get. Okay, so what, what you're really saying here is that I'm using a card index. And when you say the card, I, I take it from the index, yeah. load it into the, de yeah, into yeah. the deck. Yeah. And then... Uh, the rest is the rest. But I really, I feel like I think I said the card because that's the only thing that makes sense to me. Now, the funny thing is that that is a method that could be done. Right. Like I could, in theory, do it that way. There's a couple of things, like you said, uh, the issue with having two cards at once that would have to solve. But like it's, it's something that I can see it being doable, which okay. is pretty cool <laughs> because you're fucking just spitballing an idea. Uh, but you're not, you're not, you're not right. So the, the, the deck, nothing gets inserted into the deck. And I will say that you can tell me the card as I open the deck. Have a drink, mate. Have a fucking drink. All right. So now we're, we're going, we're going into the mentalism genre. I have one more for you. All right. So here's your, here's your prediction, Michael. And I want you to take this die. You're going to roll it, like roll it and cover it and okay. then look inside to see what it is, but don't like. Don't make me, don't let me see it. Yeah, you got it? Mm -hmm. Okay. You just tell me stop whenever you want. I'm not even sure what some of those things are. Okay, stop. You sure? Yeah. Lift up for the camera so we can all see what number you and have. And you. Yeah, it's fine. Four. So we see one, two, three, four. Yep. And you said stop wherever you wanted. You rolled wherever you wanted. And I gave you that prediction before this whole thing started. Yep. So number four. Is what? It's a Rubik's cube. I don't know. Let's see what let's see what the prediction says. You read it out loud for everyone at home. It's inside a sealed envelope. He's uh, it's not a very good seal, but that's that's fine. <laughs> what does it, does it say? say? The Rubik's cube. Where's the camera? There it is. The Rubik's the cubes, Rubik's ladies and cube. gentlemen. If it was loaded, you could swap everything but the one that was loaded, and I wouldn't know. We're at the point where the alcohol is severely <laughs> impairing my judgment. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. You don't like it. But I will be thinking about this for the next week. All right, all right. I mean, I'm, you know, I'll, I, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Okay, I guess I'm drinking. There we go. Have a drink. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was the sixth hours.